The CFR option provides the mandatory technical controls for compliance with 21 CFR Part 11 regulations on access control, user level management, electronic records, electronic signatures, and audit trail. Star E enables access control to the application, user level management, electronic signatures, and audit trails. Part 4 of this series demonstrates how to activate and review audit trails in Star E software. An audit trail is a chronology of the who, what, when, and why for a specific data record. The built-in audit trail functionality in Star E software generates complete audit trail entries, which include links to the corresponding records, user IDs, original and new values, reasons for change, date and timestamps. Upon activating the CFR option, the system and analysis audit trails are permanently switched on. No user has the ability to amend or switch off the audit trail. The System Audit Trail and Analysis Audit Trail can be found in the main menu bar once the 21 CFR Part 11 Compliance option has been successfully installed. Click on the relevant icon to view the System Audit Trail. The audit log contains data entries for all past activities relating to the system. These include starting the software, user logins, and any changes made to the system configuration. Useful filter criteria also allow you to limit your search to specific actions, users, and timeframes. For example, from the drop-down menu, select the action Star E Software Startup. The username Miller and key in the date after which you would like to view the entries. In this case, all data entries prior to the inserted date will be excluded from the list. Finally, click Update to display all entries corresponding to the specified criteria. To print the selected audit trail entries, click Print and confirm with OK. It is also possible to export the audit trail in text format. Simply click Export, key in the file name, and save it in the preferred location. Select the Analysis Audit Trail to view all entries that have to do with the analysis of samples. For example, Jones Ronald signed the evaluation PET on the 29th of August, 2018, at 7 minutes and 7 seconds past 11. In this example, Jones Ronald is the user. Signing the record is an action. The evaluation is the record type, and PET is the record name. The Filter Criteria option allows you to filter by Action Username Date or Date Range and Record Type. Once you have made your selection, click Update to view the refined list of entries. The CFR option in Mettler Toledo's Star E software provides complete secure and easy to navigate audit trails that meet Part 11 requirements for technical controls. For more TA-related how-to videos, please go to www.mt.com forward slash TA dash videos.